Have you ever wondered how your favorite online store seems to know exactly what you are looking for? Every time you browse, add to cart, or wishlist an item, you are leaving clues about your style, favorite colors, brands, and even shopping times. Data scientists jump in, analyze these patterns, and create a super personalized shopping experience. Suddenly, the store is showing you just the right pieces at just the right time, almost like it's reading your mind. That's data science, turning your clicks into a shopping spree crafted just for you. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. If you're already a data science enthusiast or just got curious about this exciting field, you're in the right place. Today in this video, I am diving into 10 essential steps to help you become the next in-demand data scientist and land that dream job. No more waiting, let's dive right in and get you on the path to your future in data science. So let's see the 10 essential steps to become the next data scientist in demand. Step number one is programming languages. Starting with Python as a beginner is a great move because it's simple, versatile, and widely used in data science. Python's straightforward syntax makes it beginner-friendly, helping you grasp programming basics quickly and dive into data science libraries like Pandas, NumPy, and Matplotlib with ease. Adding R to your skill set is valuable because it excels at statistical analysis and data visualization, two essential parts of data science. You can be comfortable with Python and R within a month or two. So, moving on to the next step that is version control system. Learning a version control system like Git is essential because it allows you to track, manage, and collaborate and code effectively. With Git, you can save different versions of your work, making it easy to backtrack if something goes wrong or to experiment without losing progress. This is especially useful when working with complex data science projects where you might try out different models of analysis techniques. One or two weeks of practice along with Python and R is good to get started. Just a quick info guys, if you're really interested, Simply Learn's Data Science with Python course is designed to help you master Python programming and essential data skill science skills through hands-on projects and real-world applications. With 60 plus hours of blended learning, live expert sessions, and lifetime access to course materials, you will gain practical experience in data wrangling, visualization, data analysis, and more. This course is ideal for both beginners and professionals looking to advance their career in data science. Get ready to dive into industry-relevant projects, enhance your Python skills, and prepare for exciting data roles with Simply Learn specialized training. Do check for the course link in the description box below and pin comments. Now moving on to the third step that is data structures and algorithms. Learning data structures and algorithms is crucial for becoming a data scientist because they provide the foundation for efficient data handling and problem solving. Data structures like arrays, stacks, queues, and trees help you store and organize data in ways that make it easier and faster to access, process, and analyze. Algorithms, on the other hand, give you strategies to perform tasks like searching, sorting, and optimizing data operations, which are essential for handling large data sets. While many candidates struggle with DAC, mastering it gives you an edge, helping you stand out in the interviews and shine as a skilled data scientist capable of tackling the toughest data problems. Spend about two months in this, you will get in the shape for sure. Now moving on to the step number four, that is SQL. Learning SQL is essential for data scientists because it enables you to access, manage, and manipulate data directly within databases where most real-world data resides. With SQL, you can create new tables, alter existing ones, delete unnecessary records, and run queries to filter, sort, and aggregate data. These abilities allow you to retrieve, clean, and organize data effectively, core skills needed for any data science role. It's easy, and you don't have to spend more than a month to have a deep understanding of it. Now, moving on to the fifth step, that is mathematics and statistics. Mathematics and statistics are essential for data science because they form the backbone of data analysis, model building, and interpretation. Topics like linear algebra, calculus, probability, and statistics give data scientists the tools to understand data patterns, perform accurate analysis, and make data-driven decisions. Mastering these areas enables you to build robust models, validate results, and tackle complex problems confidently making you a well-rounded and skilled data scientist. Make sure you spend two months to grasp these topics. Now moving on to the step number six, that is data pre-processing and visualization. Learning data pre-processing and visualization is essential for a data scientist because these skills make you data accurate, 
insightful and easy to understand. Python libraries like NumPy and Pandas are crucial for manipulating and creating data, enabling you to handle missing values, filter out noise, and prepare data for analysis. Once the data is ready, visualization lets you uncover patterns and communicate results effectively. Libraries like Matplotlib and Seaborn help create clear, impactful visuals, allowing you to interpret trends and convey insights in a way that's easily understood by others. Together with these tools, make data pre-processing and visualization fundamentals for effective data science. If you have a solid foundation on Python and mathematics, you will get a good understanding of data pre-processing and visualization in a month or two. Now moving on to the seventh step that is machine learning fundamentals. Machine learning fundamentals involve understanding how algorithms enable computers to learn from data and make predictions on decisions without explicit programming. The two main categories are supervised learning and unsupervised learning. In supervised learning, models are trained on labeled data to make predictions while in unsupervised learning, models find patterns in unlabeled data. Popular tools like TensorFlow, PyTorch help build and train complex models, especially for deep learning. While SkyKit Learn is essential use for simpler machine learning algorithms and data pre-processing. These tools make it easier to implement machine learning fundamentals effectively and build intelligent data-driven decisions. Dedicate about three months to understand the core of machine learning. Now coming to the next step that is deep learning. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning that focuses on algorithms inspired by the structures of the human brain called neural networks. Deep learning uses neural networks with multiple layers of in dozens or hundreds to learn complex patterns from large data sets. Specialized types like Convolutional neural networks, that is CNNs, are great for image processing, while recurrent neural networks, RNNs, are used for sequence data like text or time series. Essential tools like TensorFlow, PyTorch, make building, training, and deploying deep learning models more accessible, allowing you to create powerful AI solutions across various domains. I think it will take about two months to have a good hold on deep learning concepts and how to implement them. Now moving on to the ninth step that is specializations. Once you have grasped the deep learning, it's like reaching a new level as a data scientist. Just as doctors specialize in areas in nephrology and cardiology, data scientists often choose to specialize in fields like natural language processing or computer vision. Natural language processing focuses on teaching machines to understand and generate human language, enabling applications like chatbots, sentiment analysis, and language transition. It's about making computers read, write, and even interpret human emotions through text or speech. Computer vision, on the other hand, is all about enabling machines to see and interpret images or videos. This field powers innovations like facial recognition, object detection, and autonomous driving. Now, you don't need to learn both. You can choose what interests you the most. Now, spend one to two months diving deep into one of these areas. Now moving on to the last but not the least step that is big data. Big data refers to extremely large volumes of data generated rapidly from sources like social media and sensors. For data scientists, learning to handle big data is crucial as it requires specialized tools like Hadoop and Spark to analyze and extract insights effectively. With companies relying on data-driven decisions, big data skills make you a highly in-demand professional in the field. Focus for about two months and you will be able to spot trends and patterns from datasets very easily. Once you are ready, it's time to build a killer resume packed with projects that showcase your new skills. Start applying to jobs on platforms like Nokri and Indeed and supercharge your LinkedIn. Connect with data scientists, see what skills they are mastering and learn from their journeys as well. Keep sharpening your own skills and when the time comes, you will be ready to crush those interviews and land your dream data scientist role in 2025. And that's a wrap everyone. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share and drop any questions in the comments. Our experts are here to help. I'll catch you in the next one. Until then, keep learning and growing with Simply Learn. Thanks for watching and take care. Staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling. Whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career, we've got you covered. 
Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.